we need to make sure that messages are communicated in this way to ensure that nobody is left behind. So partnerships and collaboration, um, always, always important. Um, fostering collaboration between the different actors, government agencies, NGOs, community groups, religious groups, uh, other stakeholders, all of whom, all stakeholders involved in disaster risk reduction, because pooling these resources and expertise together could enhance uh, the effectiveness of both the systems and, of course, the preparedness efforts as well. Monitoring and evaluation, moving on. Sorry, I realise I'm over time here. Uh, these processes need to be constantly monitored and evaluated with, of course, a feedback mechanism to kind of refine the alert systems and preparedness measures over time. So to conclude, um, linking early warning systems with preparedness efforts through these strategies, communities can enhance their resilience to disasters and reduce the impact on lives, livelihoods and infrastructure. So here are some of the resources that I've drawn on. Apologies for taking a little.